purchased a Dell Inspiron 15 3000 series notebook. When I was researching various products, reviewers of this computer did note that it was slow, but it checked a number of other boxes I was looking for, such as storage and Wi-Fi, and the price was well within my budget for this new toy. I am not using this computer for gaming or graphics, but it does run more slowly than I would like, so I'm adding memory to it. This should increase the speed at which the programs and files open and operations overall. The Inspiron comes with 4 gigabytes of memory. I'm adding a second stick of DDR4-2400. Sometimes when we add memory to a computer, it's easy. With this HP, for example, all we have to do to access the memory is to loosen two of the screws and you pop the cover off and the memory is right there to access. Not so with the Instagram. There's a bit more to process. Let's take a look. Close any programs running, turn off the computer and unplug it. Remove the battery. Open the back of the laptop by removing all 11 screws. Use a small magnetic dish to keep track of the hardware. You can magnetize your screwdriver by running the screwdriver over the magnetic dish. When all of the screws are removed, flip the computer over. Next, remove the keyboard. We can do this with guitar picks. Carefully lift the keyboard away and disconnect the ribbon cable. Set the keyboard aside. Remove the four screws from under the keyboard and flip the computer over. Remove the DVD and then the three screws beneath the DVD. The next step is to open up the computer to access the memory. To do this, we remove the back of the computer case. Unsnap the back of the case and lift it off. I'm using guitar picks here again, but there is a tool called the Case Cracker available for purchase. I prefer the guitar picks. Once the case is open, you have access to the memory slot. There is an empty slot located just above the manufacturer's memory. Place the 4 gig memory stick in the available slot. And that's it. The laptop is upgraded. Now we reassemble it in reverse order. gigabytes of memory to my Dell Inspiron, so now I have 8 gigabytes of RAM. The performance has improved, programs do open faster and operations are faster overall, but it's not as fast as I thought or as I had hoped. This is not really a problem because as I said I'm not using this computer for gaming or graphics, and it's good enough for my needs. Without the extra memory, the speed of the Dell Inspiron did test my patience. The extra memory makes the computer more user friendly. It's a simple fix and you can do it yourself.